The suspect, who fatally shot three officers in Baton Rouge on Sunday before being killed by police, has been identified as a former Marine sergeant. Gavin Long, a 29-year-old African-American man, was, according to a person briefed on the investigation, from Kansas City and affiliated with an anti-government group. This image was published on a Twitter account linked to a website called convoswithcosmo.club, a site registered by a person identified as Gavin Long from Kansas City. In a tweet posted on Sunday, it reads, Just because you wake up every morning doesn't mean that you're living. And just because you shed your physical body doesn't mean that you're dead. Just fire, officer down! Just fire, officer down! Sunday shootings happened at a shopping centre not far from the Baton Rouge Police Headquarters. Southside of the Cannibal Safari, we got an officer down. Apparently officers saw a man carrying a rifle and dressed all in black, standing behind a beauty supply store. We do not have a 20 on the shooter, he is not in sight. Possibly sniper. Police now believe the gunman lured the officers there to ambush them. I'm hit. Left arm. The three officers killed were 32-year-old Montreal Jackson, seen here with his wife at his police graduation, and here with his baby son. 41-year-old Matthew Gerald, a father of two daughters who served in the Army and the Marines. And 45-year-old Brad Garafala, a married father of four children, who was East Baton Rouge's deputy sheriff. Three other officers remain in hospital where a vigil was held out front. Sunday's shooting comes just two weeks after police in Baton Rouge shot and killed black man Alton Sterling, an incident that led to protests in the city. It also follows another police shooting in Dallas last week, where five officers were killed and nearly a dozen injured.